I'm Jason Adam Mazel. I'm the writer, director, and co-editor and producer of Punter. Um, uh, Punter is the story of a young boy in Johannesburg, South Africa, that's trying to surprise his dad for his birthday, and the dad ends up corralling him into helping him make a seemingly harmless horse racing bet, and things kind of get out of control. It was, um, I guess, the what helped with the edits was just I think I had a very clear idea of how the tension was going to kind of like um, build in the script and I knew there was all these building blocks that I needed in terms of the footage on set and it was the, the edits turned out to be um, such a rewarding experience because uh, the performers are just really good and the actors are really good and it was mostly just about like everything just refining everything and sort of tightening it and then I had an incredible co-editor come on near the end that like helped me really polish it that actually turned it into a movie um, so like everything else in the film it was just really fun open crazy collaboration that sort of just like kept on refining it and um, yeah just trusting my collaborators which has always kind of steered me in the right direction with Tiago who plays Brett in the film the child actor he would never acted before and um, I kind of was very intentional about casting a non-actor in that role um, just because I feel like um, just children are so authentic not having put on performances um, and then it was just about collaborating with him and his parents about like finding the ways that he's most comfortable and the ways that he um, sort of um, just to get the most out of him in terms of that performance and a lot of it was just trusting him as well like everyone else on set just treating him like another collaborator and just being very open and communicative of you know, my experiences of dealing with, you know, when I was growing up of dealing with my dad and dealing with gambling and, you know, kind of all these, um, all these things that were very personal to me, I realized, oh, if I want to get a good performance out of this kid, I just have to be very genuine with him and very authentic. Um, and that wasn't always easy. And it was always a bit strange having to like wrangle him into like an empty kitchen while on set and sort of like pour my heart out to him. But he's an incredible kid and his, his parents are amazing. And I'm so happy with his performance in the film. Um, and yeah, it was just like with every other collaborator on set, just trusting them. I think that's just modern day South Africa. That's just like where I grew up in Johannesburg, just all these different characters from all walks of life all sort of convening in this, the irony of it is is that it's a very collective celebratory space but it's under the guise of this very sort of like sort of morally ambiguous thing such as gambling so that was sort of like it's you know that's that's baked into the character of Johannesburg as a city is that sort of diversity and the craziness of all the characters um, and yeah that was just that was me trying to sort of do justice to um, trying to say something not just about my relationship with my dad but about South Africa as a whole and what it means to be a born free, a South African born after apartheid ended and like what are the kind of the, um, the ambitions we had and the broken promises we may have experienced as a country or as, an, as a country as new as our own um, and yeah I just wanted to sort of, there was, those were always things that sort of like the things that I questioned and things that I kind of ruminate on myself and I thought like I, I wouldn't do justice to the wonderful complexity of my home if I didn't make the audience think about those complex things as well. I mean, in short, it's the future version of Punter. I still have a lot to say with these characters, with this world, with the story. Um, yeah, currently in the midst of figuring out the best way to um, express those feelings in the longer form, because a short film is a short film and a feature film is a feature film. But yeah, I'm incredibly excited. And it's effectively, yeah, same characters, just an expanded world and maybe some new surprises that people won't see coming, but just, yeah, the same characters that kind of just more in-depth explore the themes that I'm dealing with in the short of South Africa as a whole and us as a country and father-son relationships. It's just a, yeah, hopefully a more interesting and even more stressful and exciting experience.